What's up? Serious Magic back with another tutorial. This is a trick that we done in the mall and got a really good um, reaction if you saw a street performing. If you didn't, go look at our channel, the aerial shot performance. Um, came up with the trick completely impromptu. We didn't know what we were going to do. But that's what you do as a magician. You just come up with tricks and do them that you think will work. This is one of my favorite tricks because I came up with it impromptu. And um, it was just going on. I didn't know. I messed up a trick. And I just went with it. It's what you do. And um, we're calling my brother Isaiah to come help us. Because this trick, you have, to ha you have to have someone to help you with it. So first, um, you want to give the deck a good shuffle. Make him believe you're shuffling it. Have your spectator pick a card. Go ahead and pick one, anyone. Bottom one, that's good. So, have them look at the card. And you're gonna place it on the top of the deck. Give it a false shuffle, keep it there. Make sure to give a fake Indian shuffle. I, f I figure with the fake Indian shuffle, I usually get reactions saying, oh, that's a real genuine shuffle. Even though it's not, I'm just pulling the two cards down like that. Oh, dropped one, it doesn't matter. Pulling the two cards down like that. So yeah, give it that kind of shuffle for realness. Tell your spectator to pick a number one through 20. What's your number? 20. 20, so we count out 20 cards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Now this is the part every magician knows, distracting the person. Now with this, you're gonna take this bottom card out, jog it a little, and palm it. Now, while you're doing this, you're gonna tell them that you're gonna, what the, their job is to do, so I'm gonna tell him. So I want you to throw the, I want you to hold these and throw the card out in there. As you see, as I gave him the card, I removed my hand. I, had, I removed my hand and he didn't notice because I was making eye contact with him the whole time. Eye contact is a big thing. Then simply palm the card, place it in your pocket. Norm, looks, looks like you're pretty normal, just talking to him, just looking at him in the eyes. You're gonna take a few steps back. A few steps back. Maybe drop the cards on the floor, ask someone else to hold them. I did this for a big group, so I had someone else hold them for me. So tell them to throw the card up in the air. Now, don't do it yet, I'll tell you when. So while the, the deck is up in the air, you want to reach up generally like this, so they don't see you already have a card in your hand. So do it like this, put your index finger down, and just remove it up, and you should catch it with your middle finger. So again, up, index finger down, flick up, you cut, looks like you got it, and then pull down. So you want to hit, you want to hit this with the deck they throw up in the air. If you get what I'm saying, I'll demonstrate it. So three, when you throw it up, three, two, one. So it kind of looks like you caught the card, even though it's in reality it was in your hand the whole time. Show it the big reveal. Looks like you caught the card. Amazing effects. Usually I got um, good claps, got some cheers, which you usually don't get in. Street magic. You, people usually don't cheer for you, but this is one of the few tricks where we got cheered on for it. Um, so, practice is perfection, as I, um, as we always say. Me and James and I are the two newly and found magicians. If you don't know who they are, go ahead and check out our Serious Magic Season 2 intro. So, um, I'll see you guys next video.